In the last 15 minutes, we got brand new information into the WRL newsroom about a two year old boy who was shot in Goldsboro this morning. We just learned that child is in critical condition and was taken to Vidit Medical Center. Police still searching for the gunman who will now face attempted first degree murder charges. WRL's Chelsea Donovan joins us now live after speaking to the mother of that baby. Chelsea. Yeah, we understand it all happened in this area here, Lena. That little boy riding in the car with his parents when a car pulled up right beside them started blasting off bullets, one of them hitting that little boy in the stomach. Larry Andreas ran out of his house after hearing sirens and started recording. I heard the shots and I went down there and this is when all the police and stuff come up. I would say about 15, I guess. Residents on Hughes Street say it was chaos around 11 o'clock this morning. I was coming from getting something to eat, came around the corner. It was like 50 police cars down that way. By noon, the road was filled with police, EMS, and detectives focused on this car. That, Impa that blue Impala right there got about 10 shots and 10 holes in it. We talked to people who live on this street. They say a two year old was shot in the stomach. That little boy is legend Armstrong. I spoke with his mother by phone. She tells me a car pulled up next to their car and started shooting. She says that car was full of children. However, no one else was injured. A baby man, it's a baby. So, you know, anytime a baby, something happened to a baby is it's, it's bad. Legend's mother tells me he was rushed to Biden Hospital in Greenville to have that bullet removed. And Legend's mother says he's alert and he's talking, so that's good news. I just got off the phone with Goldsboro Police. There's no suspect information yet and no one has been apprehended. Back to you. Just so disturbing. Good news that the child is alert. Chelsea reporting live in Goldsboro. Thank you.